It's very interesting thing how you can learn to use Linux. There are multiple ways. Number one, the internet. Now since Linux development and everything is driven from the internet, there will be a huge amount of people. There is a huge community. People crazy about Linux, people developing Linux. They want to support you. So whatever problems you post, there will be a solution. Probably there will be a solution already. You just have to search on the internet before even posting it. Because there are thousands and millions of users facing similar problems, thousands and millions of people again on the internet doing it out of their own interest and not for money and anything. There's a huge amount of articles, knowledge, blogs, sites dedicated to problems in Linux, solving them, learning Linux. There's a huge amount of knowledge available on the internet. See, if you are learning something, you're going to talk about it to your friend. Your friend is going to catch that like a disease, like a virus. Then you'll have a group of people who will be discussing Linux in classrooms. That's how I learned Linux. I had friends who knew Linux. There was an internet who, which has all kinds of knowledge on the Linux. And consider this, Linux is open source. Even in the worst of the situations which I haven't faced yet in all these years, if you can't find a solution to something or if you want to do something which is not possible, there is a source code for it. You go ahead and do it yourself if you can put that kind of time. Linux makes everything possible. It does not make you dependent on any single organization or a person or a group of people. That's the beauty of it. If a person genuinely wants to learn something, there is nothing more worth learning than Linux itself.